Beautiful world, beautiful people. We are here once again, man. You know, it's a beautiful day. Indian country, Indian land. You know, just walking through, mobbing through. You know, just walking through, mobbing through, showing y'all, you know, what I be on. Ah, uh, it's, it's a simple topic today, man. Simple topic, man. Understanding your self-worth. Understanding who you are. No matter the situations or what might be going on, you have to understand who you are. Bro, I did a lot of separating, a lot of venting, you know. And this is not to make excuses, bro. I've made mistakes in this whole shit. In this, Indian country, this Indian country journey, I've made a lot of mistakes, bro. You know what I'm saying? But at the end of the day, I knew that some things, you feel what I'm saying? I had to cut off and let die, bro. It's what it is, bro. Does it make me less of a man, you less of a man, you more of a man, me more of a man, bro? Our actions determine that. Our success determines that. You feel me? So, you know. Early morning get right, man. I'm walking. Once again, like I always do. I love walking, man. I just, it's peaceful. It's serene to me, bro. It's calming to me, you know. Um, I push the V when I need to, when it's necessary, you know. Business, things like that. But, um, yeah, man, understanding your purpose, bro. One thing you have to watch out for is going to be a lot of people out here that's going to try to tell you what you're worth, bro. You feel me? It doesn't matter. See, this is a thing, bro. This is a thing, and this is just a concrete fact. It doesn't matter what you're involved in, what you're doing, bro. It's not what you do, bro. It's how you do what it is you do, bro. That determines your character, bro. You feel me? Because I have a lot of people say, oh, you know, you active gang member, this, standing third. Let me put on the record, bro. Ain't nobody out here advocating violence. You feel me? Pillaging the community. Nobody's doing that. You feel me? At the end of the day, everything that goes on is a mutual understanding. First and foremost, nigga, there can be no destruction of a community without a mutual agreement, bro. From both parties. I'm not just talking about the person that might be selling the drugs or causing the violence, bro. You feel me? In order for a community or anything to be destroyed, bro, it has to be a mutual understanding from the people first, bro. Because... Bro, the people is what makes up a community, bro. The community, the government, and none of these things would be anything without the people, bro. The people really hold the power, bro. The people hold the power. You feel me? So it's not so much of what it is you're doing, it's how you do it, bro. You feel me? I got a lot of people that might, I wouldn't get involved in the things that they're involved in, but do good deeds, bro. I, I use Malcolm X for an example a couple, a couple videos back. This is my number one role model. I love this man, bro. You wouldn't know that, bro. From looking at me, bro, or letting other people tell you about how I move, bro. I love that, man. Do I agree with Islam? I don't at all. I hate it. No disrespect. I don't. But the actions of that man spoke for itself, bro. I can, I can surpass that, bro. I can surpass that, bro. Because your actions, bro, and your accomplishments done prove everything, bro. You feel me? So my whole entire point about this, bro, is not so much of what the hell it is. That you're involved in. Because everybody want to make you feel bad. And it's crazy because the same people that's down in me. Or trying to, you know, character assassinate me. Because I deal with the gangs, bro. Or gang members. I used to be gang members, bro. Wow, Indian, bro. You scream BD all the fucking time. What are you talking about? That's another issue. I didn't, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't do this post. To get up here and slander, bro. You feel me? I did this post in order so you can know, bro. You determine your destiny, nigga. Don't nobody else do that. You feel me? This internet got everybody thinking that that this is real life. This ain't real life, bro. This is, bro, listen. It's, it's, it's called, it's a fragment of reality, bro. It's augmented reality, man. You feel me? This ain't real, what you see up here. Now, some of it is. Majority of it isn't, though, bro. You feel me? You got to know your purpose and what you're here for, bro. No other man can determine that for you. No other man can determine that for you. 
Motherfuckers want to pick and say, oh, you 35 and you still... And I'm 35, bro. I'm not 40. I don't know where you keep getting this cap from, bro. I'm not that, bro. I'm 35 years old, bro. Am I still searching for certain shit? Yeah, bro. Do I know who I am spiritually? Of course, bro. This is what people don't touch on. My specific place in this world, this physical world, do I know where it needs to be specifically as of right now? I'll be honest. No, I don't. No, I don't, bro. Because it ain't the same as it used to be. I'm still learning and going. As reality produces itself daily, bro. You feel me? So, of course, I know I got things I need to learn. Hmm? And I don't mind that. But at the end of the day, bro, what I won't do is let sucker niggas make you believe that this is how it go. Because of this internet, bro. It's not, bro. It's not. It's not. I never one time came up here and told y'all that I was anything other than what I portrayed myself to be, bro. Whether people like that or not, that's up to y'all. Y'all got to make them decisions. Y'all said be real. That's exactly what I'm doing, bro. Niggas... Talk about my kids. Talk about my baby moms. You feel me? Those of y'all that know, I don't even swag like that, bro. I don't even have that type of demeanor, bro. You feel me? Am I always around my niggas? Yeah. Niggas don't even understand the type of individuals that I'm around, bro. You feel me? These is my kids' godfathers and shit like that, nigga. Now, don't get it fucked up because y'all see us up here getting fucked up. Of course, we always going to broadcast our success, nigga. But what are y'all really doing, bro? On her. You feel me? I don't got to wait for no motherfucker to tell me, bro, come pick up your check, bro. I'm not knocking those that work. You feel me? Real men work for themselves, gang. Real men work for themselves, bro. You said you told me post a pound. I posted a pound. What are you talking about, bro? Stop the cap, bro. Everything that you trying to make it look so you can make yourself look good, you... Bro, wild Indian. Yes, I'm talking to you right now. Wild Indian, bro. You was foaming at the mouth, my nigga. Literally. Don't make me run the tapes back, nigga. It's, 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 it's public information, gang. You was literally foaming at the mouth, bro. Talking about me, gang. But saying at the same time you're not bothered. I can't tell by your physical reactions, bro. You're foaming at the mouth, gang. Come on, bro. We can do better than this, bro. We can do better than this at the end of the day. We all got a certain path, bro. My path not going to be the same as yours, bro. I never fucked with you neither, bro. At the end of the day, bro. You feel me? You call me at work talking about your raps and all this other, this, that, and the third, bro. That's neither here nor there, bro. It is what it is. What's done is done. What's done is done, gang. But at the end of the day, bro, stand up to what you proclaim to be. Wild Indian, you wild Indian, right? That's the name Moon gave you, right? Wild Indian, right? Stand up to that, bro. That's all I'm saying, bro. Talk about me straddling the... Like, bro, you're still BD, bro. You ain't walked outside and say I denounced anything, bro. To the homies, bro. Because they'd be the fucking Pope out you. So stop playing with it, bro. Stop. You're BD, my nigga. You're a gangster just like me, bro. Is what it is, bro. You got different paths. So, like, stop trying to make your shit look less. And make my shit look more. When it's the same thing, bro. You're a fucking BD, gang. Cali, you're a fucking crip, bro. Stop it, bro. I understand for the cameras and all that other shit, you gotta... Nigga, I'm still gonna scream this Indian shit and let niggas know what time it is, bro. This is the type of time I'm on, bro. This type of time I'm on. I'm not saying it's negative time, bro. But when you approach me, you know how to approach me, bro. Because it's more than just this Indian shit, bro. You understand what I'm saying? So, at the end of the day, man, y'all already know the vibes. Stick y'all in here, man. Truth knows no bounds. TV, bro. I'm your boy, Chief Nedger, nigga. You feel me? Chief Nedger, bro. I don't got a cap for the camera. I don't got to do none of that. A lot of niggas run their fucking mouth, bro. Oh, you got ones and mm-mm-mm. Not even going to pull out on you, bro. I would already pulled out on you. You talk about you done put a stack up. These stacks up here on, on, online. Where's that? Where that video at, Goofy? Where the video at, Wild India? You putting three stacks up here, bro. Let's do it. Let's do it right now. Let's do it right now today. Let's do it right now today. Let's do it right now today, nigga. Stop it, bro. You cap. I'm not that. Yo, listen. NFTs. Get involved in that, bro. Cryptocurrency is the next move, bro. Get involved. 
You feel me? Because a lot of niggas thinking, oh, yo, bro, you just, you, you dick a little diamond, this, that, that, bro. That's my block. I have to come out there and see what the fuck is going on, bro. At the end of the day, you niggas is washed up has been ass niggas, bro. Slide so we can show you how we living, nigga. Slide so we can show you how we living, nigga. You feel me? Slide. I don't even believe y'all niggas is like that, bro. Cali, listen, boy. I will punish you. Stop playing with me. Wild Indian, I will punish you. Stop playing with me, bro. Y'all niggas is not like that, bro. You not. And you gonna see, bro. In a little while, soon, here to come. I predicted every time, every prediction that came, Aboriginals to fail. I already seen it. Shit with Aboriginal power. I seen it come down. Listen, my nigga, y'all niggas is not scholars. Y'all not none of that, bro. Y'all come here, bro, and this internet make you be, make you believe that you're something that you're not. All you do is regurgitate information that other niggas. Yo, let me play this audio. Let me play this shit. Where's your shit at? Where's your content? I edit. I do music. I fuck with the studio. I do all of that, bro. I do all of that. Cali ain't even fucking with me, boy. I do all of that, bro. You feel me? And I could do half, half of this shit I do from my phone. I don't even be on my laptop, bro. You feel me? It's, it's, it's for a chosen few, man. So, you know, shout out to the ones that's, you know, out here trying to really get this get this shit up. Trying to get to it, you heard? That's just all it's about, man. But like I said, man, truth knows on bound, man. Get involved in the NFTs, bro. Cryptocurrency is, is the next wave, bro. This is what you want to be involved in. This is what you want to have your investments tied up in. I'm not saying all your investments, but a nice amount of your investments and tied up in. You feel me? Because this will bring back a lot of bread, bro, on my mama, bro. And I ain't even posted, like, how I really want to go in. You feel me? But at the end of the day, man, invest in yourself. Invest in those that you love. Invest in those that you know you can count on, that you can trust, so y'all can move forward. And get up out of these things that's going on, bro. You understand what I'm saying? So, boom. Y'all already know, man. So hurt in here, man. Trip Nedra. Hmm? We here now, man. Top is now, man. Shout out to the idiot, man. Y'all know the vibes, bro. Easy.